All right, here we are with another episode of the uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle Japanese Edition. I just realized I've been labeling it SA2 JP for Sonic Adventure 2 Japan, when realistically this is Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, so it should be SA2 B. Yeah, SA2 B for Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. But uh, anyway, yeah. So. I've been sitting in the room, waiting for the child to evolve, so on and so forth, and uh, one of them is about to evolve. It's a uh, Lip, which I didn't name him yet, but Files I want to show off real quick how he looks before he evolves. I wish I would record in between, but I'm trying not to like make recordings and then have multiple uh, uh, video files and then stream them together using a video editor app. I'm trying just to do one recording, go, and then end it, and that's it. So, I'm going to show you what he looks like right before evolution. Uh, like I said, I want to show like in between a little bit, but we're not going to be able to do that. Let's be Shadow since he's going to be the one who's going to be uh, evolving into a Dark Chow. So yeah, this is going to be the Dark Swim Chow. I decided I am going to uh, reincarnate Gel. Because I'm not going to get them all to level 100. And I was thinking about getting level 50, but guess what? They're all around level 30, so I'm just going to do that. So here's good old Lip. I'm gonna go name him right now, actually. No. Never. Let me name my own child. Oh, okay. is there a cute eye or something? I like that one. That looks cool too. Yeah, I like that a lot. Is there a trippy L I can use too? Nah, that works. Ah, uh, yeah, I like that. Hell yeah. Sweet. Yeah, he loves his name, dude. Check it. Alright, we might as well, uh, name, uh, the other child. I forgot what I was gonna name him, though. I think I remember. All right, so there's Lip. He's gonna evolve soon. I don't know what I'm gonna name you yet. It's gotta be something cool. I'll wait till both of you evolve. Cause I get their animals on there, but... Yeah, so yeah, check it out. See, he's looking... He's looking more like uh, Mr. Green did, you know? His wings are even getting blue and stuff. And this fart knocker. Yeah, <laughs> lazy bones. Alright, I remember feeding him right away. And that's when he evolved, then I turned off my GameCube right away, because I was like, nope, we're catching that. We are recording, right? Good, okay. Hey, what happened to the dude? Oh, he's up there. And that's Gel chilling in the water over there. I'm, I'm just having him hang out so he can reincarnate faster, so... There it is. Yeah. yeah, what's up? For that. I can't even do it. Dude, I can't even do the sound. And that means the other guy's gonna evolve really fast too. So this is probably gonna be a two-parter. What the hell? What? They're evolving twice! Like, around the same time! No way! Oh, come on. Let me see you. Hang on. No, real quick. Alright, so that's him now. We'll find him later. Yeah! Look at that, dude! Good old lippy boy! Oh, he looks sick, dude. Oh, if the other one pops off right away? Good lord. 
Dude, he looks sharp, man. Dude. Yeah, I love it too, man, but I gotta go see your buddy, okay? Back in a supersonic second. And this is the normal chow, and I was wondering what the name is. We're gonna get him otters, because otters are cute as fuck. It's so weird how there's no sound bit for a neutral chow, but a hero chow and a dark chow get a sound bit. But the other two don't? That's just weird to me. Doesn't look much different. I mean, a little bit. Yeah, I guess his face is a little bit more... I can't stop thinking about War of the Worlds. Alright. Well, I guess we'll wait for this guy next. I hatched them around the same time, though. Shouldn't he hatch? Well, let's go save. Before he turns into an egg form real quick. I mean, evolutionary state. While we're doing that, let's find some freaking otters. I mean, why not, dude? I already know where to find an otter. I don't even have to look for it, man. Look, look, get out of YouTube. Change my shit off of that. There we go. Don't need Wi-Fi on. Alright, Chaos Chow. Oh, uh, excuse me. Alright. Alright, time to find some otters. I love how games put in that light like that. Oh shit. Don't want it. There. Uh, I see one. Oh no, you don't. Yeah, I'm out. Man, I'm getting hungry. We just got the uh, VHS tape. Or VHS, the uh, horror movies, you know? I watched one of them on Netflix a really long time ago, or maybe it was YouTube. It's at my old apartment. And I love the ooh. Yes. Yeah, but anyway, I found one at Walmart and it was a three uh film feature. And uh my girlfriend when I met her, she was telling me how there's more than one movie. And I was like, get the fuck out of here, there's more than one movie? I'm just gonna restart it, fuck it. Sadly, child boxes don't work when you restart, but who cares? But yeah, so she was telling me her mom watched them. She never watched them, but she said her mom's a big fan of them. And they made more than one movie. And here, I'm under the impression there's only one movie. So when I found the DVD, I, uh, I kind of like, Oh, dude, these are all three of the films. I didn't know there's three. I just know there's multiple of them, right? So I look at them, and one of them, this is how the titling works. It goes... 1995, a VHS 1995, then it says VHS uh, 99, and then it says VHS 85, or something like that, and I'm like, why are the numbers so weird, like they're not in order, you know, so the last film they said is 85, and then they said the first film is 95, and then the middle film is 99, and just like, that's weird to me. You think they go in order, but that's only how the the disc case, the DVD shows it, and in back when they're saying like the description of each movie, they put them in the order that makes you think it's like out of order. So I'm thinking that's just for the plot, like maybe they found a VHS that was recorded in '95, you know, but that was the first movie, and then the last movie's '85, and the middle movie's '99. I don't know. I'm gonna Google it before we start watching them. Or maybe when I start the DVD, it'll, it'll tell me which movie is first anyway, so the order, so I don't know. Or it could be that thing where, like, they they make the movies out of order on purpose, you know, so they can tell the story right. Like, they make prequels and shit like that, you know, so. I don't know, but I'm excited. We just watched a movie last night called Creep, and it was recorded, 
And that's what made me think of VHS. It was recorded through a camera. You know what I mean? Kind of like Cloverfield or like, um, Quarantine. Uh, what's another good one? I can't think of any off the top of my head. But, uh, yeah, movies like that that's from a video camera, really, I like those movies. But, uh, a scene out of Creep, there was a dude being recorded in his bed, and the camera wasn't moving, and then all of a sudden the camera moved, so you know someone else is in the room with him. Right now I'm getting chills, I'm getting goosebumps. And, uh, that scene reminded me from a scene from DHS. Uh, I don't know which one I watched. I know it's the one where, like, a couple goes, like, camping. I think I can get it. There. I know it's the scene where a couple goes on vacation, and apparently, um, some weird shit happens, and, yeah, people are recording them in the hotel room. So, it's really creepy, but that scene reminded me of it. That's why when I saw it at Walmart, like, babe, can I buy this? I'm like, yup, I'm like, yeah. Want me to do it? Oh, I have to do Shadow. Yeah, but I'm excited to watch one of them tonight. It sucks. I want to have popcorn with my movie, you know? And I already ate popcorn last night, so I feel popcorned out. But, you know, I don't know. Okay, come here. I hope he doesn't involve him trying to feed this dude. But that was fast. Get those whiskers. <coughs> I hope he doesn't get the level 30. Just by these. If my chow are a little above 30, it's not the end of the world. Yeah, he's got the whiskers too. I know, I love you too. Here, take that. Did you evolve yet? Where is he? I think that's everything. I ah, look how cute he looks. Little fins, dude. Alright, I gotta check on. Yeah, okay, so they're cool. You know what? Give me that. That's what I'm gonna name him. That's right. Finn. I'm gonna name Finn because his little flippers. Well, his little, like, his wings look like flippers. And I got that idea when I was making my Chaos Child. Like, oh, it'd be cute to make another one of these things and name it Finn. And it was like, ah, oh, too bad I already got this guy named Mr. Green, you know? And his name was only Mr. Well, it was Mr. Yellow because his egg. And I started thinking of Mr. Green from Trailer Park Boys, and the otter was green, so it's like. But now he's a chaos child, he's just yellow. He has green eyes, though, so that's kind of. Eh. Alright. Then. Oh, girl. No. Whoa, what am I doing? Boy, there we go. Yeah, that's good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Like I said, I'm probably gonna go back and just get rid of all the boy and girl names on it. Make it easier. I'll do that all off screen. Screw it. I'm gonna keep on doing it forward though until like I do them all in bulk. I have no idea what I'm doing. So cute. I take another otter. Why not? Hmm. Oh, I can't wait for the grind for the phoenixes. What stage am I gonna do that on? Even is there an easy way to get phoenixes? Remember, I was trying to figure that out. I don't remember. Hey, just in time. Not the best angle, though. Right when I found him. What's going on here? Get tangled up. Give me a bitch waiting for gel to reincarnate. I think I'm gonna do that first thing. I think I'm gonna pause streaming. I'm not gonna record gel reincarnating. Maybe I will do it with the flight chows, I don't know. I'll see how old he is. I'll wait till he's on his last year. His eyes didn't change at all. 
Usually angel chows have like blue eyes and stuff, but he's straight up still just lazy, man. Oh! Hey, what's wrong? <laughs> I'm taking the dock real quick. Seems fine, alright. He's just hungry or something, I don't know. Alright, time to track down some phoenixes. Ah, oh, you getting tired, dude? Don't go to sleep yet. Oh, wings look cool though, look at that. <laughs> Dude, I dig those wings. Too bad I gotta get rid of them because I'm getting a phoenix shell. I don't care. Gotta get phoenix shell. Alright. A phoenix. Don't we get one to Metal Harbor when we collect all the boxes? Why did I do that? Why do I always go there? I know Missing Street Street has a Phoenix somewhere, but I don't remember. It's at the bottom. You only get it once too. So that's not worth it. And I always miss the top child box. I can never fly up there. Like every once in a while I can, but like where the bridge falls. We'll just grind this. Seriously? Oh. It's gonna be such a long grind though. Because before I had to do this for the Chaos Chow, but now I have to get like a whole bunch of Phoenixes. I remember as a kid I did it on Missing Street for Tails all the time. You know, it sucks to me collecting Chaos Drives in between this whole damn thing. Alright, now at the exit. Then restart it again. That's gonna be annoying. Well, I think I'm gonna do this for a little bit and then uh, continue the stream once I get back at the child guard. Oh shit. Yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so I'm not on my game at all. I only got three phoenixes. I kept on dying. I thought I could do a trick with the child boxes. Where I just kill myself, reopen a box, and it would continue. Totally didn't work out. Where is she? In the water, of course. Here, make that. All right, cool. They don't. All right, not looking bad at all, dude. That's pretty good. All it needs is the hands, I think. I 
I'll grab like three more phoenixes, grind through it. It's hard too, because I'm trying not to get chaos tries, but it's kind of like, I have to. Because it's, it's impossible to hit those flying enemies, you know. And half that map is like, hitting the flying enemies. There's a segment I was trying to get the first child box, and I was trying not to hit the enemies, I was trying to take the lower path, and then jump backwards, and I was just, I did not have control of Sonic whatsoever, man. It was horrible. I was dying a lot. But you saw, I, I had like a good amount of lives, now I have only 91. Like this, I was trying to skip this. Trying to skip all this. Like usually I take the lower path and I want to jump backwards, but I hit him and then I hit that. Like my angle's off, man. Now if you come up front, like hit all those enemies in the front, it's a lot easier to perform. But then you have to hit the two on top. Well, you don't have to hit the two on top. You can hit the, uh... You can skip these two. Then jump here. And then hit these. Then you're up top. And then you have a better angle to hit this thing. What's up, babe? Where'd you get that? Yeah, what? Alright, I decided to continue the grind. Uh, Light's working on uh, Jinx's cage right now. Or tank, whatever. Make it a cool, like, rock top, you know, out of foam. So, just trying to figure out how to decorate it and stuff. Uh, it looks really cool. Um, don't you go to sleep yet. I will wake you up. Oh, it's got its tail now. Sweet. I don't think it has arms, though. Yeah, it doesn't have arms, which I prefer it not, honestly. Awesome. Heck yeah, she's looking Stella, dude. Dude, that's so cool. You know what? That's what I'm naming her, too. What's up? Come on. Alright, all we have to do is wait for a gel to reincarnate before I get the flight child doing which uh going which is gonna be cool because i'm gonna get sonic Aven adventure and the uh, game boy Advance and convert the child the black one and the gold one i'm not gonna do silver i want to get some uh skeleton dogs too i think because they have animals on them i don't know if that converts because some of the animals like the kangaroo and elephant aren't in this game so it leads me to believe the animals that they do are the same like a raccoon and a seal, they have that, but their seals are orange in Sonic Adventure. Sonic Adventure 2, they're blue. That leads me to believe, since some of the animals aren't in the older game, they just wipe all the animals when you transfer them. Which would make sense, if you transfer it to the Game Boy, they can't have animal things. So it probably wipes all the animal, not the stats, but the actual animal, you know, cosmetics on it. And it will get rid of it, and then when you put in Sonic Adventure 2 from the Game Boy Advance, uh, Sonic Advance, then it should be wiped. Technically, I don't even need to put it on Sonic Advance. Technically, I could just use the Game Boy Advance without Sonic Advance in it, which I might do that, just to show you guys that you don't need the game, which I already did that, that's right. I already showed you the tiny child garden without Sonic Advance. I remember doing that. Oh, uh, what am I doing again? Stella. Is there a cool S down there? No. Alright. Not even a cool T, dude. Yeah, why not? Looks like a happy face. Stella. Yeah, I like that. It looks like eyes instead, but usually I do like two little mountain symbols. I forgot what uh, what 
that is in text talk, but it just looks like a little smiley face, like a little like happy face. I do it at the end of all my texts. Stella. Doesn't look happy to be Stella. <laughs> like I said, I wish it wasn't Oh now she's happy. Like I said, I I wasn't too happy that uh she had that face, but like I said, variety, so it's kind of nice. Alright, so we got our uh, swim chow. Hero swim chow here. We got our normal swim chow. All the hair. And then we got our dark swim chow. Which is probably the coolest looking one in my opinion. Let's go ahead and take them down to the normal garden because I don't have room in the dark garden anymore. At least I think I don't have room. Is that actually Phoenix? Oh, get out of here. Here, have this last one. Dope. Yep. Take you down first. Why are you always so sad? Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. I'm gonna feed you. Yes, yes. That silver egg is calling me. I forgot. I still gotta save up for the hats, dude. Oh my god, I forgot about that completely. I gotta get some more trees too. After they're all like level 30, I gotta run them through the races and see if that's enough to win, like, at least the beginning races. Those are tough though. I remember I was trying to get my speed chows to win the beginning races, and I had to get them a little past 30, so I don't think that's gonna work out too well. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Alright, let's go get, uh, what? I already took Finn down, or took Stella, so now I need to go get Lip. Lip, where's your punk ass? Wait. I already took lift down. Okay, my bad. What are you excited about? Yes! <laughs> Stella's uneaten frickin' fruit. He's like, ah, oh, dude, leftovers? Sweet. I'll take that. You left some fries at the bottom of the bag? I'll eat that. Right, I'll see you nice. in the flip, buddy. Oh, actually, let's see where everyone's at. What's time we got? Or oh, just about to reach the end. Alright. Whole house. Oh, I had a lot more room down here than I thought. Shit. Alright, well... Yeah. I'll probably take Lip down here then. And I'll leave, uh... Actually, I'll grab a uh, Lip and Finn. Take them downstairs because, uh, Gel's gotta go down there anyway. 
so out of order. My god. Looking good, though. Oh, yeah, I should check out their stats. Alright, so he's 32. So, no more run for him. 21. What are you at? 20. Okay, good. Wait, wasn't there other speed chow? Oh, yeah, he's speed chow and he's speed chow. 21. Okay, cool. You're the only one that's higher. And then you, yeah, you, you're getting reincarnated. By the way, before this ends, I'm gonna go find out where he's at, which we just hit the 30 mark. You're gonna see where he's at. I'm just curious. First, let's take these two down. Where, where are they? No, I can do that later. I can do that off screen. Alright, you fart. Come here. No! Because if he's at age 5 right now, I might as well just get that over with. Maybe I could take care of him at the same time as the flight child, though. I'll just make a speed during I'm making the uh, flight. Where am I going? I don't know. No, I don't want to check him out. I know he's perfect. Stop it. I'm at the Pokemon Center. God damn it. Keep on pressing A. He's still age two? Oh my god, dude. Oh, what? Oh, fuck me. Okay. I gotta hang out there for a very, very long time. I'm gonna do that all off, sp off screen. All right. Yes, yes. Okay, so that is the uh, swim chow, all three of them. So uh, I will see you next time, and we'll start busting out the Sonic Adventure game, transferring the chows. Like I said, I'm leaving the silver one. I know they're all supposed to be brothers from another game, but. I don't know, I'm doubting myself. Maybe I should just hatch that silver egg and get rid of it. We'll see how I feel, because it would be cool if all three of those child came from Sonic Adventure, and they're all brothers, that's why I'm getting them all masks. You know what? I think I made that decision already. I'm getting rid of that shiny silver egg. I'm getting rid of that thing. Yup. Anyway, there it is. Swim chow. Flight, and then... Done. No mean light can actually do versus mode. PvP. So... Rock on. Renegade, and be yourself. Peace out, dudes.